Okay, today I'm going to show you how to fine-tune a model in the new um, SDXL 1.0 fine-tuning possibilities in Night Cafe Studio. So the first thing we want to do is go to My Models and find what you want to do. Now, it's a pro-only um, feature, apart from um, you get one free face model. So that's what we'll do. So you click Come Into Here what model do you want to type so we're going to do face we'll call it my face one and sdxl and and here you've got some information choose 16 to 64 images the photos should not include other people should not be close-up portraits um they're, they're sorry they should be close-up portraits so no full body or wide shots more photos is generally better, more variety. So if you wear different angle, if you wear different clothes, do it from different angles with different lighting, etc. That's better. The one I'm doing, because it takes so long, um, I'm just doing um, 10 selfies. Uh, I'll show you now. So these, that's all I'm going to use. So you hit add image, and I think I've got. 19 images here um, the more images the better and it would have been better if I had you know different clothes on the lights on lights off bright lighting face full light and side light and all that kind of stuff but in this instance I'm just going to show you this so once it's validated everything we will be good to go the what it then does is trains the set or change tra trains the image set and you end up with a model. So we don't want to add more. It tells you a little bit more about here. So it's telling me I've only chosen 19 images. Yeah, okay, it's probably better if I've done it over that. It is an alpha feature, so the likeness might be out. No, no safer work creations, not even slightly, are allowed. Um, it doesn't generate images. You've got to generate the images yourself. Um, and if you want to train the same model with more images, you have to start from scratch. So I would advise you not to delete any of the images that you create. We hit confirm that. Let's just see if all of these are validated now. Yeah. Start training. And it is now 10.15. So it will take about 10 minutes. Training in progress with my big cheesy grin. So I'll be back in 10. Okay, the training's now complete, and I can and I know that because it now says use this model. So if we click on use this model. I'll just I'll do it with a preset and I'll do it with a prompt. So let's have a look what have we got. Uh, what do we want? What do we want? What do we want? Let's go for a watercolor. There's loads and loads of presets now, and I believe these are probably pre-trained presets for face so ones that have already been done so let's just start with watercolor I'll make 16 of them um, where is advanced prompt editor that's what I'm looking for so what I just wanted to see the the details so watercolor artistic process po gee whiz artistic portrait of that's the model I trained blank paper background watercolour skin tones turquoise teal warning SDA is a bit unpredictable with multiple positive prompts okay let's put that no I'll just leave it where it was that's a negative prompt so it's not actually saying it because there's two it's just telling me that you should just do it in one prompt, really, and use a negative prompt if you feel the need. So let's hit create. And let's go back to my models. Use this model. Advanced prompt editor. I'm going to delete this. And I'll keep that. And we'll go sci-fi portrait of and then I'll remove all of these and I will put in uh, sci-fi space scape uh, 
uh, 3D UHD Cartoon Sci-Fi Portrait Right, let's see what that does And if we come to my creations, it's okay. So the watercolour one's pretty cool. It's not, you know, I wouldn't recognise that as me, but, and I don't know why it's, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, out of the 16 that I don't even have a face. So I guess, with it being an alpha, there's probably some stuff they've got to iron out, I guess. But it's not bad, they've got the glasses in every one of them. Probably got my big nose as well, my larger bottom lip. Yeah, it's not bad. Let's see what this one's going to be like. Okay, that's now complete. Let's have a look. So, yeah, it's not really what I was expecting, and it doesn't really look like me either. I can see how it's added the sci fi background, sort of space and a planet there. But, yeah, but anyway, you get the idea. So you get your photos and, you know, I just took 19 selfies um, and it does specifically say not to do that. So take your photos, we're using different clothes, but, you know, close-up portraits, you know, not full body, not wide-angled shots, different clothes, different lighting, different face expressions, upload them and then go about your prompting. And hopefully you'll get better results than I did. They're not bad, but... You can see they need more work. Anyway, thanks very much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. It helps me um, keep creating these videos for you guys. And I'll see you all in the next one. Take it easy.